One year ago, I made a video on the Astro A10s, and I said that they were pretty good and felt nice and durable, not to mention the sound quality was amazing. About three months later, I made another video which went quite well for this channel, about 35,000 views. There were some concerns raised in that video about the price that I suggested them being $100. I'm going to clarify that in this video. Also, this video is marking the one year anniversary. I've had these headphones for 12 months now. I've used them, my wife's used them, and my daughter has used them. Are they still working well? Let's find out about that. All right, here is the Astro A10s. These are the original Astro A10s that I received a year ago. Now, the first thing that I would like to clarify about these headphones, I did state in the last video, and I think in the original one, that these things are great quality for the $100 price point. Now, a lot of you will question that, saying, why are you paying $100 for these when they retail for $60? Allow me to clarify, these are not $60 in Australia. There is a difference in the exchange rate between Australian dollars and US dollars. Roughly $60 US is around $100 Australian. So the retail price is a reasonable price, $100 for these in Australia. Now you can, if you hunt around, get them for about $89, which I've found uh, in, in some of the stores. But the retail price, $99.95. Now let's get into the quality of these things. They are pretty much still in the same quality as they were in that first video and that three month video. These things still are standing the test of time and the I guess the, the wear and tear of just general daily use. I don't necessarily use these every day because I have a different set for my computer, different set for Xbox and PlayStation, so I do swap and change a bit. But when I'm not using them, my wife is using them and she still uses them all the time. Now let's have a bit of a close up look at these things. Now, while they do have, I guess, some dust and some dog hairs on them and, <laughs> and obvious fingerprints and wear and tear and the overall condition of these things is pretty much perfect number one the sound still sounds exceptional it sounds great the microphone still works exceptionally well as, as well as the swivel arm has no issues with it uh, the, uh, the the automatic mute when you close them up like that still works it mutes the headphones and there's there's really nothing wrong with these things I, I don't get it I bought a $300, $400 pair of headphones a few years ago. I had a little bit extra cash after I sold an old piece of crap car of mine and I bought a $400 set of headphones. Those things have fallen apart. There are pieces on it that have come off. Uh, I'm not gonna name them. This isn't a shame video. This is really just talking about the quality of these Astro A10s. Now, th look, th there's just, it's still as good as it was. I, I don't know really what else more I can say, but these things are amazing. I was planning on probably buying a new set of these once these wore out because I was so happy with them. And I figured that for the price point of $100 or $89 Australian, I could, I could justify probably buying a new set every year, maybe every year and a half, two years. But these things aren't showing any signs of weathering. The, the, the printing on it isn't rubbing off. Uh, nothing is creaking it all the adjustment still feels like it originally did it's nice and firm uh, I'm, I'm really blown away by these headphones and let me be clear as well I did receive these free of charge from Astro and there was no agreement entered into for me to do any subsequent videos these ones there was really just they were given to me to do a review of and an unboxing which I did a year ago and uh, the, the three month follow up video was so popular that I'm doing this one and uh, I'm doing it because I want to and these things are truly great. If they were rubbish, that would be even even more of a fun video to do for me to bag them out, break them or whatever. But they're not. They're, they are so bloody good. Uh, I, I don't know. It's, it's the Astros. Um, these, these headphones alone have converted me to an Astro fan. I think they're great, and uh, if you're thinking about picking one up, check out my original review, check out my three-month follow-up video, and this one, obviously, I'm still amazed by it. I can't recommend these enough, and I'm not sponsored by these. These guys aren't paying me, or they probably don't even have any idea that I've made the follow-up video that I've made this one, uh, I'm guessing. 
Now there's a few people that commented on my previous video, the three month follow up and said that uh, thanks to my video, they were gonna go out and buy one. What I'd like to hear, hopefully I can get some of those viewers back to watch this one. I want you guys to tell me, did you get one? Did you get a, did you get a pair of these? Did you get a pair of Astro A10s? And what are your thoughts on it? Are you happy with them? Did I recommend a good product to you? Did I recommend a dud? Did you get something that doesn't work? Have you had problems? Because I've not had any. Are you guys happy with my recommendation of the Astro A10s? Let me know in the comment section down below. Uh, they're golden headsets. They may as well be gold. Thank you very much for watching. My name is Lucas and I'm from Aussie Gamers Express. And who knows? I might be back in another 12 months still using these headphones. And if I am, you'll be damn sure I'll have another video on it. Thank you very much for watching. And until next time, I will see you.